morning vlog. Um, yeah, so today is Monday of seventh week. Obviously, as you can tell, I'm not in Oxford. I'm just about to go and get the train back. Um, I have like just a lot of ad mini bits to do this morning and then I'm going to start my plan for my essay tonight. Um, hopefully get it planned and then write it tomorrow. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a, it's hopefully going to be a better week this week. I have still got this negative mindset and like a bit of a brain fog and I know that like it will lift, um, but I just have to keep thinking positively and keep thinking about all the good things that are happening and hopefully that will transpire in it being a better week. I have a grammar class at, no I don't, I have a speaking class at three and a grammar class, no I don't, I have a translation class <laughs> at 4.30. Um, the translation wasn't the best one I've done because I kind of did it yesterday and I was just in a bit of a funk and stuff but I, I've explained that to her so she knows but Hopefully, 7th and 8th week, we'll be looking up and I just got to focus on my work, on my friends and all the good things that are happening and just hope that it will all pick up because I'm sick of the vlog titles being so negative, but there's nothing positive to put in the titles. Not this week, kiddos. Not this week. <laughs> less amazing but was amazing 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 <laughs> <laughs> I just said I smile, know. like, uh, it's not I just, that difficult. I just, I just craving the attention. <laughs> <laughs> plans just to write my essay plan tonight so I can write the essay tomorrow um which shouldn't be too hard to do um I only have two lectures tomorrow so I'm literally going to spend the day in the library apart from those two lectures and um, I have no other plans but I do have plans Wednesday night Thursday night Friday night so, so that's why I want to get it done now um and then at least make a start on my next essay because I know that if I don't get this essay done tomorrow I'm just gonna be so behind next week so yeah that's what I'm doing right now uh, I'm just replying to some YouTube emails while I'm eating my dinner and then I'm going to do that. So it's already half past seven. Like, I'm going to have to work quite late tonight and then have a shower and sort my life out. But that's okay. Because sometimes you just got to, as all of you in the comments seem to keep reminding me, that it's okay to just spend my life in the library. That's not horrible at all. <sighs> but yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> hey guys, oh my god, what a night. Oh, so much has happened. Like, just like personal stuff, but it's been oh it's been real it's been real guys um i got um an essay plan written so i've got my plan um i've sorted out my sheets action plan for the week so now i'm going to quickly whiz around my room and tidy it go to bed get up shower go to my lectures come back bang out the essay go to the schubert concert what an amazing day it's gonna be good <laughs> good morning it's tuesday the weather is beautiful today so i got up at seven had a shower dried my hair, went to breakfast, got ready, uh, just quite leisurely really. I have a lecture at 10, I have a lecture at 12, then we're going to eat lunch outside and then I'm going to spend the rest of my day writing my essay uh, and then we have a LMH concert this evening at like 9pm so I'm hoping I'll finish my essay by then. Um, if I haven't finished it then I'm probably not going to go uh, but yeah that is basically today's plans. Uh, Ooh, today, this week, I just have a much better feeling about this week, to be fair. Um, not academically, but like, just mentally, it's going to be better. And yeah, my hair looks so blonde today. I'm so here for it. I'll show you my outfit, actually, because I'm wearing something that's not a jumper. Shock. 
So I have this crop top on, which is from Nasty Gal. And then I have these mom jeans on, which are from Topshop. And everybody hates them because they've got massive rips in, but I really like them. So tough. And then I have my blue Converse on, which I have not worn since like year 11. Because I just never wear colourful enough outfits. But today, today kids, they are out. <laughs> Also, I just want to clear this up because, quite frankly, the comments on my last vlog have jarred me uh, about, like, oh, yeah, you complain about the workload, but you still go out and, like, do stuff. I'm like, obviously, I need to stay sane. Like, I know for a fact that last year, during my A-levels, when I literally did nothing but work, it permanently damaged my mental health. I don't want to do that again. Like... If I take a day off, it's not because I can't be fucked. It's because my head is like, it needs one. Or like, everyone was like, oh my God, like you had this essay, but you went to the bar. I was like, yeah, because I'd just been sat there for five hours reading and I needed some space. Like, I get it, all right. But I'm pretty sure every other fucking uni student complains about the workload and still goes out and does stuff. Like, I'm human and I'm not going to spend every living waking minute of my life working but I'm allowed to complain about the workload because it is a lot. Like, that is the point, is the only way that you could not be stressed about the work here is if you don't do anything else, which is just, like, it defeats the object. So, yeah, just thought I'd clear that up. You can comment all you want about my time management skills. I've always been good at time management, and you know what? I'm quite enjoying the liberty of perhaps not being as good at it for once because I'm deliberately enjoying myself a little bit more, you know? Um, it's a human thing to want to do. And it was a lot of work that week. And it was actually quite unsustainable because I would have had to have spent the whole week in the library, and which everybody here knows, if you do that, you literally go mad. Like, you can't function as a human being. So, yeah. I'll manage my own time, thank you. Uh, thank you for the concern. Some people were really, like, genuinely quite constructive, but other people were just like, oh my god, like, oh my god, like, what are you even doing? Like, I'm trying to live my best life whilst also doing well academically, which is difficult. <sighs> I'm not paying £9,000 a year just to sit in the library. Like, I want to enjoy myself too. Thank you very much. Okay. Thought I'd just put that in there because it was just one comment too many. I was just like, right, I need to talk to you about it, so, yeah. It's Wednesday, day I have a lecture, no I don't have a lecture, I have a class at 9, a lecture at 11 and then I'm going for lunch with Rosie in University Parks and then I have a class from 2 till 4 and then I'm going to the Hillary Term concert tonight. Um, it's so sunny again today, I've left my black converse back at home and I'm actually kicking myself because I like my signature look is skirt, tights, black converse and I'm having to wear my boots and I don't like wearing my boots. Um, but yeah, um, the weather is beautiful. But I'm carrying so much winter weight at the moment. Like, I literally caught myself in the mirror last night. And I was like, oh, my God. Especially on my stomach. Like, my stomach is usually pretty flat. But right now, it's just not. Like, there's a lot of jiggle um, that I don't really like being there. So, as of today, a month of cutting out the crap. At least trying to cut out most of the crap. 
Um, I've indulged quite a lot this term um, with a lot of alcohol, a lot of uh, meals out, all of that, which is fine because like winter and like I do it every year, but as of today, no, because I've got two months until VAC ends, like from today pretty much. So hopefully I'll be looking good for Trinity because I know that I will just regret it if I don't like try and get rid of all of this like excess pudge because I'll just feel rubbish all the way through Trinity. So yeah, I mean, it's not not like I'm going to go on a diet or anything. I'm just going to eat less crap. <laughs> um, Still eat crap, but in minimal quantities, you know? But yeah, oh wow, this lighting's not cute. Um, My skin also is not not enjoying the amount of crap I'm eating too. So all in all, I think, yeah, less crap would be ideal. Like This is a non-stage social situation, <laughs> Rosie. It's fine. Say hello. Hey. Say hey. We're in university parks. Oh, this is the only time where I can actually talk in my vlog clips because I know that you guys won't be like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> sometimes I literally just like lift my camera up sort of like awkwardly in these situations. I never am like, hey guys, so I'm in the parks right now. <laughs> Hey guys, sorry my skin's literally falling apart. I've been picking at it. Um, I've just read a quarter of the book. It took me two hours to read a quarter of the book. Not ideal. Um, so basically I'm gonna go to this concert now and then come back and do a translation and a bit of grammar work and then edit a video, have a shower and go to bed. Um, I just really want to bang out all of my work um, apart from my seminar prep for next week by Sunday so that next week literally all I have to do is the reading for the seminar, which is going to be really complicated, and that's kind of all I want to focus on next week. So I'm trying to do that so I can really enjoy Monday and um, Sunday, Monday, and like I have lots of plans this week and next week, but it's just a case of like shoving it in. Um, it's just a bit difficult because I'm going straight to work experience after this, which I'm so grateful for. But like because I have two weeks of work experience and another three days of work experience as well, I can't really. I'm gonna have like three days off when I get home from work experience, but I can't really have any longer off than that because I need to revise, um, which is such a ball ache, but I, it's it's the same as A-levels. Like I just gotta keep going until, um, until June and then I can collapse and heap on the floor in June. But just things never ending right now, as you can tell by my skin, my skin hates it too. So I just edited a video um, when I got back. Rack Malinov was so good, like literally like amazing. Um, but yeah, so I've just edited a video which is going up like not for another couple of weeks. It's going up um, like mid-March because I'm on work experience for two weeks, like as soon as we finish. So I'm not really gonna have time to film that many videos while I'm in London. Um, but yeah, so that's that. Um, I need to just put some like pseudocrem on the spots because they're awful and then I'm gonna head to bed. It's literally just about to go 12, so I've nailed it really, but yeah. Okay, see you later. Morning guys, so today I have a lecture at nine and then I'm filming something for like o Oxford Outreach at 12.30 and then I have peer support training from 2.15 to 5.15. Then I'm going to a film screening, which we have to go to. Love that for me. Um, From six till like eight. When am I gonna get any work done today? I don't know, like. <sighs> man guys i got set so much work last night for next week like i genuinely thought at this turn like at some point this term i would have like 
a lol and there's not been a lol and I can't cope without a lol and I need a lol please somebody give me a break but yeah okay essentially apart from the law sock ball on Monday and the bop like that sort of 24 hours I'm just busy until 5 30 on the last day of term so we stand can't wait yeah, this is my outfit today just some mom jeans and jumper mom jeans always make me feel really like big like because I know you know that that's kind of they are bigger but yeah, they're more comfy than skinny jeans. And I'm just in that awkward stage where I don't quite fit into like a lot of my clothes from last summer, but I also don't fit into the size above. So I'm just a bit like, okay, I need to like get rid of it and then I'll be fine. But yeah, these jeans are from Miss Selfridge and they're just generally really cute. So I'm off, see you later. <laughs> So I just went to that film screening and I had piss poor, like today was crazy, but so much better than last Thursday. My skin is actually all, like, guys, I don't think my skin has been this bad. I can't remember the last time my skin was this bad. I don't know what's going on with it. Um, yeah, hopefully that'll go because I really don't like it when my skin's bad. That's like one thing I just can't cope with. It's like all here as well, which I never get spots. Like, Wow, it's just shocking, really. I'm going to whack a load of concealer on, put some makeup on, and I'm going to bridge tonight, okay, before all of you are like, oh my god, I thought you said you have so much work. I do, but I've just done an hour and a half of reading. Like, in the, I literally got back, did the reading straight away, done that, um, and I'm not going to do more work tonight anyway, so I'll get up and finish it tomorrow and write my essay plan tomorrow, write my essay on Saturday, do all my other work Saturday, Sunday, and I'll be done. I'm caught up by law sock ball, so it'll all be fine. I have thought my time through and I've managed it well before any of you attack me, okay? Um, but yeah, I'm off to get ready now and hopefully cover all of this and make myself look more presentable, which I'll show you now. Outfit top is from Nasty Gal. I'm not really, I don't know if I like it or not. I feel like it makes me look a bit bottom heavy i mean i am bottom heavy but yeah um and then also like this band of fat is just what i'm trying to get rid of at the moment so it's not ideal but this skirt's from bershka face i literally have got like no makeup on i'm not gonna lie guys but it's not like it matters anyway <laughs> um my skin is so bad i don't want to put too much makeup on it so yeah i'm just going out for a lol anyway yeah okay i'm off <laughs> guys so it's 3am and I'm walking back to LMH by myself I've not done this before I always come back with someone but today was not that day alas everybody else went off with other people and I was like well I'm not doing that so on the way back to LMH by myself it's all good I've got my college husband on the other side of messenger he's like staying awake till I get back so it's all fine um, but yeah, it's really weird walking up the street at this time of night, like, by myself, because it's, like, literally half past three in the morning. No one's about. I walk down the street, like, all the time, um, to go to my classes, and it's just so quiet. I didn't get a sayings, guys. I know, it's a new start, a new me. I'll probably regret it in the morning, but we'll eat something when I get back, so it's fine. Yeah, we're going up a little clown strip right now, and um, it's all right, nobody's following me, so I'm all good. Um, but yeah, it just really made me think actually about how, like, when my college husband walks back by himself, like, nobody makes a second thought about it. But then when I walk back by myself, I've got like three people on standby in case something happens, and it's just so shit that, like, that's that's like what the situation is because it's so crap. But... I feel this is what life is like as a woman in the 21st century, but now I really wish I got her saints because I'm really hungry, but we're trying to lose that weight, guys, so probably for the best that I didn't, but just so you know right now, I sincerely regret not getting one. Hey guys, so um, my plan to do reading this morning, 
has uh, not really materialised. And by not materialised, I mean it's 10 o'clock and I'm <laughs> still in bed. Uh, may or may not have took it too far last night. May or may not have a fat, fat bruise on my knee. I literally, I remember falling over. And I remember being like to Lois, oh no, this is going to be like um, really bad in the morning. And then I was right. Um, I'm not going to lie to you, I'm feeling a bit worse for wear. Uh, but that's my fault. I will just have to work hard this evening and hope that this hangover lifts. Uh, because right now, it's not really feeling great. Um, yeah, I'm going to go back to bed for 20 minutes and then quickly scramble together, go to this lecture, go to this class and then collapse in a heap. When I can't even collapse in a heap, I've got work. <laughs> Just having this 20 minutes to myself, okay? Okay, bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> she did that. Just because you recoiled. <laughs> With Reese. That was so unenthusiastic. How are you going to get... How are you going to win the approval I'm of my viewers if you're like I'm that? Depressed, depressed. Why are you depressed? Eighth week. Is, is it eighth? I don't even know. It's seventh week on. Oh. So. We're on the way to Tashi's with Anna's. Oh, do you want to get in it with your oh, no. bicycle hat? <laughs> We're on the way to Tashi's and Anna's because they're doing a Have I Got Quizzes for You? For you. Um, and I'm wearing <laughs> my Santa hat, which doesn't fit my head. I've got my helmet on. Yeah. I have no other hat. And uh, it's going to be really, really fun. And this is making oh, my head shape look Hello. really bizarre. You are flashing. Yeah. She's flashing. Safety first, kids. Safety first. <laughs> Morning, guys. So I'm literally going to leave my phone in my room all day. Just going to be in the library. So I need to make an essay plan, do the reading, write about half of the essay. And then once I've written about half of the essay, I'm going to do the rest of my work. Like, I don't have too much to do, but I still have like a fair bit. So then hopefully I can finish the essay tomorrow morning. And then we've got a little sock board. So should all be good um hopefully we'll be on track i just there's not much critical reading online so i'm gonna do a little bit this morning um and then write just start writing because you know it might be worth seeing what i can write without doing critical reading anyway so yeah guys i'm being held hostage in my room <laughs> Lindsay is threatening to throw a spider at me if i open my door i know i know it's the principal I'm not happy. I want to go out my room. I I know. I I don't have anything against spiders as a species. I just don't like their legs. Like, uh, this is horrible. Guys, please just let me out. <laughs> Don't! I don't want to! I really don't want to! It's not! Olivia has made an amazing lentil cottage pie. It's vegan and we're all going to sit and watch a movie out here. And it's going to be so cute. You happy with your cottage pie? Look at this cheese! Amazing! Oh well that kind of defeats the point of being vegan but... <laughs> Do you rate it Lindsay? <laughs> Morning guys, so it's Sunday today, um, my skin's actually cleared up a fair bit overnight, we love Sudafed, not Sudafed, we don't love Sudafed, we love Sudacrem, um, I'm just sat writing my essay, um, it's about minor characters and I'm kind of wishing I'd pick the other question now but we're gonna have to stick with it, um, but yeah the law sock ball is this evening so I'm just gonna work until about 12 I think, just on my bed, um, I was gonna go to the library but I'm quite comfy here so I'm gonna sit here and just have a cup of tea and work and yeah but hopefully I'll have all my work done by 12 and then I can enjoy the little salt ball which will be really nice um, and I've even painted my nails I know guys I know next thing you know I'll actually be shaving my legs that's gonna be a real a real who <laughs> hey guys so I finished all my work um I'm just I've just had a shower shaved moisturized exfoliated blah 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 it's actually really nice to like pamper yourself shame that my skin's not the best but I hopefully I've got enough foundation left to cover it I'm not even sure if I do but I guess we'll find out imminently anyway so yeah I'm now gonna uh put my joggers back on and dry my hair so it's got time to sort itself out and then curl it so it's got time to drop and yeah lots of stuff to do ready to go for the little sock ball not gonna lie could not zip my dress up <laughs> lol properly but we're just gonna go with it anyway where's cordelia oh she's not there 
Oh no, come back. Looking stunning. Uh, my room's a mess, but like, what's new? Yeah, we're gonna go take some photos and then we've got to get a taxi and then we're going on the coach. So exciting times, basically, but yeah. I don't, literally, this dress is making me feel like you a lump. You do. It's just not the most flattering dress, but like, we're gonna, we're just gonna go with it anyway, it's fine. Um, but yeah, let's go. You know, so it's uh, one o'clock. I woke up at like eight and then I went back to bed till ten. I've just sort of been sat watching YouTube videos, scrolling through Instagram, doing nothing of value really. Uh, I'm just learning my presentation, which is for a class in like two hours. Then I'm returning to my room and start to pack. And I also need to film some Instagram stories. But yeah, fun times. <laughs> So I'm just heading to my class now. I've re I've learned the presentation, so I'm just gonna go do it. Come back, um, pack before dinner, like start packing, um, and to put in my vac storage. And then once I've done that, um, I need to have dinner and then get ready for Ollie's twenty first birthday. It's my friend in third year, which should be really really exciting. Just sort of like recurl my hair a little bit and um, <coughs> generally sort my life out. But I'm off to my class now, so exciting times. You owe me lots of things, Amy. <laughs> and the star is born. Emily Wilkins getting her debut on my YouTube channel without even knowing. Stunning. What? You've got your debut on my YouTube what? channel. What? Oh my god! <laughs> 
you said you wanted to be on it. I did. And now Hi you fans. are. <laughs> hey guys, so I just went for dinner. Um, we just sat in common ground like for a while, which is this really nice communal workspace. Um, I sat with Amy and Emily and Hannah, which was really nice. Um, so I'm quickly gonna do an hour of packing. What time is it now? Yeah, pack for an hour and then get ready. And then it's Ollie's birthday and then the bop. So sorry if there's little, very little, um, so no, like watch worthy content, but I'm trying. Ready for the bop slash Ollie's birthday. I'm wearing this skirt, which I'm not the biggest fan of, like again, midriff, but whatever. Then this bralette, which I always wear. This is from Bershka, Nasty Gal. Primark, the bralette, um, and then my boots because I left my Converse at home like the idiot that I am. But you know what? I'm not totally mad about this outfit. Curled my hair again, got some makeup on. Yeah, okay. See you later. Guys, so we're going to the pop now. And now is here too. This is my costume. Okay, so it's supposed to be ironic, like, I've got like number one student on because I won the tab power 250 which we all thought was hilarious because like Malala one, be not yeah but like Malala literally goes here so I'm wearing this ironically as you can tell look ironically but it's not ironic she thinks she's the best student <laughs> <laughs> we're going to the bop anyway Fever, we're getting our tickets let's bounce honey yeah. Yeah. Off to get our sayings. Nearly there. We went before everyone else. The club just closed, so we were like, let's go before we get a queue. And it's amazing. <laughs> I know. I know, same. Hey guys, sorry for the noise in the background. Oh my God, guys. It was a fun night, but I'm regretting my life right now. <laughs> Let me tell you. Um, so I've got two lectures, a class attitude today. Idiot, like I'm an actual idiot. I'm just gonna go and like sit through them and function as a human being <laughs> um, for a little bit and then just come back and sleep and then do all my work tonight. Um, but yeah, I'm off now to my lecture. But they're doing the meadow, which is really exciting. Um, I have been so excited for them to do the meadow, like, this whole term. So that's really, really nice. But, yeah, I'm off. <laughs> You've reached peak and poor Hannah's just stood there with her cheesecake, like, don't even talk to me. No. <laughs> Hey guys, poor show from me. I know, I'm literally not vlogged today. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to put you up somewhere. Yeah, so um, I have just, I've been dead. I'm just really hungover. <laughs> like, I don't really know what else to say. It's um, currently about half past 10. I'm literally gonna go to bed now. So I, what did I do today? I went to a lecture and then I went back to my friend's house to sleep, like between my two lectures and then just didn't wake up and my friend was like I'm not gonna wake you because you clearly need to sleep so I sort of slept and just spent the day like existing I had a class I wasn't really in the class like I was like oh my god I had a chew uh yeah my essay was like fine my essays I feel like for Jen would have been worse this term I don't really know why but they have been like not worse it's just like I just and maybe I just don't get on with the questions as much but I just can't seem to like get it just right um, but yeah, so then I came back and I went for dinner and I've just gone and sat and worked for like four hours, um, which was, you know, good. Tomorrow I have a class at nine. I'm going to get up first, have a shower, have a class at nine and then I have a lecture at 11. I have an interview uh, for something exciting at half past 12 and then I have class from two to four and I have a peer support meeting at seven. And then I'm going to work tomorrow night. I'm going to finish my work. Um, and once I finish my work, I'm going to Park End because I'm a responsible human being who's going out three nights in a row this week, which I know that all of you are going to comment on because all of you, well, okay, not all of you, a significant minority of you love 
to uh, comment on my way that I live my life, which is so welcome, I love it. It really just makes me feel so great about my life choices. Um, but yeah, it's eighth week and quite frankly, I want to enjoy myself after the last couple of weeks. So yeah, um, dinner was amazing. It was pie and it was mushy peas. I literally was like, oh my God, this is literally what I needed in my life. It was so good. But I'm so bloated because it's um, on the way to that time of the month. So feeling pretty grotty, but yeah. Anyway, I've just sat and spoken at you for like way too long. I'm gonna go and put my peas on and go to bed. I'm so excited to get to bed. Oh my God, you have no idea. <laughs> Morning guys, just got out of the shower. Um, oh, bit of mascara under there. Busy day today, I'll try and vlog what I can, obviously. Um, but yeah, I'm literally running out of clothes now. Like I have not done a wash uh, since sixth week. So I'm literally running on whatever clothes I have left, which is good in a way, because it's forcing me to try new clothes. But yeah, um, I'm gonna quickly get changed, dry my hair and then go. The weather's a bit grim today, I'm not gonna lie, so. Yeah. Hey guys, so I've just got back. Um, I'm literally so bloated. Don't help myself. Like, I over back. I'm it all, all this weight is going. Like, I feel awful in like. I've just been lazy with food this time and it's caught up with me and it always does this time of year but I, I've got, I've only got myself to blame if that makes sense so over that hopefully I'll get back to my normal sort of how I feel normally um, and um, yeah so I'm just gonna go to the library for an hour and a half then I have a peer support meeting then I was gonna make myself dinner but I've like mm, I'll see if I'm, I'm not really hungry so I think I'll leave that oh, it's too I'll see. And then I'm, we're going to Park End um, tonight, which is exciting. Although I am running out of clothes now. Um, Staring's just gone and put a little bit in the wash for me because I need clothes when I get back because I'm going out the day I get back um, somewhere. But um, yeah, okay. I'll go to the library now. Fun times. After my peer support meeting, I literally like, I've made the executive decision that I'm going to this peer support meeting and then I'll come back and I'm just gonna sort everything out that I need to sort out and just watch a movie and go to sleep because I'm shattered and now, I got about three, four emails while I was in the library and my day tomorrow is just, like, I have no break between 9am and when we go out for Tiger's birthday. There's literally no point in me, like, running myself to the ground tonight. And I just, like, I'm practising self-care, which was my peer support homework this week, but I'm not going out. But right now, I'm going to my meeting and then I'm coming back and going to bed because I'm shattered. This is the grandma life that I lead, guys, but we are also going to go hard tomorrow, I feel, because, it's, again, when you go out with anyone that's not a fresher, you just can't not exist without getting absolutely off your face. So, yes, that's my update. Thanks for listening. <laughs> morning everybody so today it's thursday um i literally went to bed at like 11 last night but i'm still shattered um i feel like this term is just being like no nope, we're done here now you're finished oh don't worry that which is a very weird concealer line okay same anyway so today i have a 9am lecture and then i'm filming with unique um just doing some promotional bits and bolts for a couple of hours then i have my personal tutor meeting back at animate and then I have um, three hours of peer support training and then I've got dinner with some of my third year friends and then it's Tiger's birthday bash at the pub slash here slash bridge slash generally everywhere and I'm very excited about that so yeah um, I'll show you my outfit for today because I kind of like it I really like these jeans but I hate there's like the top rip you can see my pants but like also I'm kind of not really that mad about it because they're cute and I'm going to order some more when I get to my lecture because they are really cute so this is the outfit, it's these jeans from I Saw It First, which are probably the nicest fitting jeans I own at the moment, probably because I've gained some weight, but they still fit. So, and then this shirt is from Forever 21, I got it literally ages ago, though, so you probably won't be able to find it. And then my face is from genetics, no, well I don't even know, I don't do biology, don't ask me these questions. <laughs> Hey 
hey guys, so I just got my reports back. Um, it was like, <laughs> it's a bit of two uh, double-edged sword because I've done like better this term. Um, uh, but like my tutor was like, I'm so calling you out for the fact that you are literally burning the candle at both ends and that you're not going to be able to keep this up. And I was like, okay, I know that, <laughs> but like, <laughs> you didn't need to call me out on it, you know? Um, but she's so right. And like, just the fact that like, perhaps I find work a bit more, more of a duty than I should do, considering I'm paying £9,000 a year to do it. Um, which is so, so fair. And like, next time I really do want to like, as she was saying, like, enjoy it a bit more and really not, she was, she was so, she's so clever. She's so wise being like, oh yeah, it's like a refuge. Like you're sitting, like you go and watch a film to escape your mind when you should want to be in your mind. Like it should be a safe space to be. And I was like, oh my God, that's so true. But yeah, um, um, even for German, I thought I was going to get some horrible comments and I did not. Uh, but my golden age tutor, if you're watching, you know who you are. And from what I've gathered this term, you have seen some of my videos. So if you're watching this one, big love to you. And I'm definitely doing golden age next year. And you've just made me want to do it even more with your lovely comments. They're all just so nice. Um, and to be fair, even though this has been like a bit of a rough term at times, it's nice to know that my hard work has paid off and that like... I don't know. It's just really, really sweet. Like, they're just so nice. Everyone's so nice here. It's just amazing. I have peer support now, so I need to leave. But, <sighs> yeah. And then uh, going for dinner with uh, two of my third slash fourth year friends. And then, um, what are we doing then? Tiger's birthday. So all good. Although, I found out we have a grammar mock on the 1st of May when we get back, which is so fine. If it weren't May Day, like, you're supposed to stay up all night on the 30th. Like, it's tradition that you go and, like party all night and then you watch the people on the bridge sing and i'm not gonna be able to do that because i have a grammar test at 9 a.m and i can't do that on an hour sleep poor show really but yeah that's that's uh that's 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 what's up that's what's up <laughs> guys i'm currently sat on the floor in my room um i've got ready for bridge i'm not wearing like too much makeup because I'm tired and I don't want to put it on, but I'm a fully trained peer supporter now, guys. How crazy is that? I've just been sat looking through the photos of this term and, like, even though I think the middle was, like, one of the toughest times I've had in a long time, it was sandwiched really nicely, <laughs> so it's okay. Um, but, yeah, uh, I'm really, really grateful for everyone that's been so lovely this term and just generally, my life has changed a lot this term. Like, a lot has changed in my life and that's a really nice thing that that's happened um without being too specific but yeah okay but yeah I'm just waiting for Molly to message me back because she's cooking me dinner but I'm so hungry and I've literally been lying on my floor like I'm gonna die of hunger but yeah okay I'm gonna go <laughs> Hey guys, it's Friday. Uh, I'm going to end this vlog here actually because I'm going home tomorrow and all that's going to happen today is me going to my two classes, maybe just like watching a film with the girls. Um, just basically not, not much. And this vlog is already 43 minutes long because I've decided to put both weeks together. Um, so I really hope you enjoyed this term's vlogs. It's been a real rocky term. Like it's had its highs, it's had its lows. But nonetheless, I'm really grateful to have made it through um, and to have come out with like working at like a first is like really really nice um but obviously like need to like keep my energies up i've got two weeks of work experience in london now so i have got a video scheduled to go ne up next weekend and i will start doing like um exam season related videos over the vacation so comment down below what videos you want to see from me related to any form of exams and yeah i'll see you very soon wow another term over absolute madness but yeah as you can tell it's kicked the shit out of me quite frankly but yeah. All right. See you later. Bye, guys. Bye.